CPD Diary Video Guide. For the step-by-step -step guide to creating a CPD diary entry on a desktop computer or laptop, the diary entry is an electronic record of your actual learning activities. There are various learning activities that you can choose from, including attendance on a course or work shadowing, for example. The activity can be backdated or forward dated. This helps manage what you have done. The first step is to click Add to Diary. This will bring up a fresh diary entry form. Here, you can input your name and email address. Your email address is important as this forms part of the security check to enable and file your entries. Your personal computer will remember these details once you have completed this once. Select from the available options for your governing or registered body. The diary entry form is intuitive, so depending on the governing or registered body you select, the form will change to meet the required fields of that specific body. Selecting non-registered or listed will bring up the options available to support generic professionals. The next step is to select how the learning activity was arranged. This may have been arranged by yourself in your own time or as part of mandatory training arranged within your workspace. Select the best description of how your learning was arranged. Next, select the learning activity type. There are numerous options to choose from. Scroll through the list whereby all possible learning activities are included. This is also a helpful section in which to get ideas for future learning and what activities contribute to continued professional development. Select the learning type which best suits your activity. Inputting a relevant title in the next text box will ensure that you can recall immediately the learning activity and later include or exclude this entry in your electronic portfolio. The next step is to select a date. Dates can be retrospective and future planned. Should you input a future date, the system will offer you an opportunity to add this to your calendar. This will also serve as a diarised reminder of upcoming training. You can input the number of hours undertaken on the activity. For example, you attend a full day's training, 5 till 9. Allowing for lunch, you have likely spent 7 hours within the learning activity. You can document any number of hours learning, including part hours. As stated, the diary entry form is reactive to the governing body selected. Therefore, further text boxes change depending on the selection or not. Each of the text boxes going forward will ask you to input how, for example, the learning activity benefited you as an individual. Following this, there is an opportunity to select the relevant key skills and standards you have met within this activity and to select and map your activity against skill-specific frameworks. Should you have undertaken online learning or utilised the internet within your learning, you can input a website address relevant to the learning activity. This is particularly useful for future review of your development, whereby you would be able to recall the websites visited and learning undertaken and review the material. If you wanted reminding when your learning activity is about to expire, for example, if undertaking yearly mandatory training, Select a periodical reminder whereby the system will let you know when your training certificate will expire and requires review. Finally, upload some evidence, such as a certificate, commendation or training material. Click Upload Evidence, which will take you to your computer's file directory. Select the evidence you require and select Choose. This will upload your evidence and attach this directly to this learning activity. You can select to upload more than one piece of evidence by clicking Add Another and following the above steps. Once complete and you have reviewed the submission criteria, click Submit. This will submit your completed diary entry to your personal CPD dashboard whereby you can review, edit, print and collate this at any time. The system automatically collates and sorts the information included within your entry, whereby your personal portfolio is chronological, relevant to your governing body, easily navigated and easily identifies your achievements.